Hi everybody, welcome back. We're doing more upper back mobility moves. This one's going to be done kneeling, which gives you a few more options when you get back to work and you have your grown-up clothes on. Okay, so we're going to be kneeling with our front leg, the inside leg closest to the wall. is going to be planted in front of us, like we're, I don't know, serenading somebody or asking for that ring. It's all about that ring. So you're going to put a spacer between you and the wall. I'm using a six inch foam roller here. You could just as easily use a throw pillow, a soccer ball, whatever you've got handy. The larger the item, the easier this is. As you get better and more flexible, you want to get that smaller and smaller and eventually be right up on the wall. So to show you the difference, we're just going to take this inside arm. This outside arm can just touch that knee for a little extra stability. And I'm going to just reach up and over and look behind me. Okay, pretty easy with a six inch spacer here. Okay, this gets significantly more entertaining when we take that away and come square over to the wall. Okay, now I'm on the wall. All right. Ooh, that is a lot more challenging. All right, so this is round two of the upper back rotation in a kneeling position. You can see I'm kneeling, or maybe you can't see, I'm kneeling with this front leg here on the ground in front of me like a kneeling lunge, okay? This leg is flush up on the wall now. We took away that six inch spacer, so this is gonna be a lot harder to get rotation here because there's not a lot of space between me and the wall. Uh, we can do this the same way we did before, where you've got your uh, outside hand on your knee and this hand's gonna come up and around and back, okay? And then back around again. Uh, or even harder, challenge mode is gonna be make little butterfly hands behind your head here and try to avoid, as you turn here, doing a whole big side bend away, right? Let's try to get rotation instead. So you're gonna reach that elbow up and back and try to get it off the wall if you really want to challenge yourself and then back again. You're going to have to side bend a little, but don't give me one of these. You're like a bad robot, okay? So again, we can have a hand here and turn. And again, remember to reach behind you and really work on that expansion feeling where we can have elbows up here, elbow up, swing around, and back. So that's two ways you can work on upper back mobility and rotation and kneeling, as well as we already practiced on the floor. All right, now get out there and practice.